How's it going guys, today we're back with a brand new video and in this video we're going to be reviewing the Dark Doctor handgun. A little bit of a backstory to the previous video. With the, new, the new Easter Invasion event came out and basically the Dark Doctor handgun is the last tier 8 prize. Normally I wouldn't make those types of videos, but because this event is so hard to complete, like it takes so so much time to complete, that's why I have to make this video to show you guys if the weapon is worth, worth it or not to get from the trial. Since like you don't have to waste all your time, because the rest is just grenades. So it's basically you're playing for this weapon. And it's gonna take you so long. So if you, even if you even whatever mask you have, even if you have the time sent, it's gonna take so long. So I'm gonna show you guys if it's good or not, so you don't have to grind the child if you don't like it, like to get this weapon and you don't like it, because you don't know if it's good or not yet. So let's see. It's basically a Dark Doctor handgun review. And I'm gonna test it in missions multiplayer. Mind that I'm using zombie bull and glass cannon, so I get double damage and double health, but no regeneration, and I have my health, so basically I have normal health, because of the zombie bull and glass cannon. Yeah, basically I'm just yapping on here. Let's just go to missions, test it on missions, and then multiplayer. So I'm just gonna do it right now, so let's see. So basically it has an active seal that you throw, that you throw this and it heals you. So basically, it's really good, because it has 50 bullets. 50 bullets. I really, I really like that in this weapon. 50 bullets is really, really good. Like, you can see, with glass cannon, though, it's the damage is weak. The damage, I, I, I'm gonna tell you guys, it's weak. The damage is really weak. So, let me show you now the activity. So, basically, wait, I need them to shoot me a bit. Wait. Okay. Okay, so let me show you. Okay, don't kill me. Okay, so the active skill is this. Look, you throw this. And it heals you. And he also heals your players, like nearby enemies. Oh, sorry, not nearby enemies, nearby allies. It also heals your friend, your teammates in Team VS. So basically, you throw that, it heals you and your teammates. Like a grenade, this. That this is the active skills weapon. And it recharges really fast, because that, that's what I like about this. So this is really, really cool. It's actually really fun to use. And it has 50 bullets, which is crazy. Just the damage is a bit weak. And let's see the range. The range is pretty good. The range, yeah, the range, the range is pretty good. It's just that the damage is a bit weak. So, and the fire rate, the fire rate is like medium. So it has medium fire rate, weak, weak damage, good range, and really good ammo count, and really, really fun active skill. So now let's see how it performs on multiplayer. Okay, so I found a really good tryhard lobby right here, which is in free for all, which they're doing the events, so people are tryharding. So let's test the weapon out. Let's see, is, is, is it really that bad also in multiplayer? It, it wasn't that bad in missions, so let's see here. That wasn't the weapon's fault, I didn't get sure. Jesus, I died from a shamrock. Nah, okay, we're starting in the tryhard lobby. <laughs> That's how all the lobbies are right here. Okay, so I killed him, but you killed me, killed the other guy, killed me. So yeah, the range is pretty good. I, I also destroyed the egg. Yeah, the damage is weak, that's the thing. The damage is weak. Like, all these weapons that kill you instantly, that's the thing. And the fire rate is pretty medium. medium. Like, if you had a good fire rate, it would, it would counteract the damage, you know what I'm saying? So everyone's just using post heavy skull and they're just killing you. It, 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 it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't compete, I think, as well. I think I need to use the Aztec Vest after this. Yeah, I need to use the Aztec Vest. So I can counter all these burning effects. So basically, I haven't completed the event yet. I'm on, I'm on tier 7. But I already have the weapon. So yeah, I, it's basically, I don't even need to play the the try 1. Because I already have the weapon. I'm just playing it for the grenades and for fun. So yeah, overall, this weapon. As I'm seeing it right now. It's not the best weapon, and it's not the worst weapon. So it's an average weapon. Like I, I don't think I, I really wanna play more in this game. Actually, let's just do, let's just play this two minutes in the game. Let's just see. Maybe I'm gonna change my mind. They just kill you instantly with a with a heavy skull. It's just jokes. But there are some weapons that counteract this. So basically, is it, as you can see, I get like, if they not if they weren't using the heavy skulls, it wouldn't be that bad.
yeah, it's a, it's an it's a actually a decent weapon. Like I would recommend you guys grinding it. Actually, I really actually as I'm seeing here now, I really would recommend you guys grinding for it. Let's see. So I let I'm gonna wait for the, I'm gonna talk I'm gonna talk a bit now f until this game ends. I'm gonna see how much kills I got. I don't think I got that many kills though, cause like we got pretty destroyed this game. I like this uh, the active skill. I like it a lot. It's fun, and it recharges so fast. That's what I like about it too. And I didn't even get the kill. Oh my god. It has bad accuracy. That's the thing. It doesn't have a thing all time or something. No, it's, it has bad accuracy. That's another problem. Bro, I'm gonna die there, right there again. Dude, they're all, the, the glitch of the Sharmark still exists. That's why everyone is spamming, is spamming it. It's crazy, guys. <laughs> My God. Don't I, how didn't even I get the points? Like, who killed? What's this guy? They're killing you so fast with those weapons. And it's like, it really doesn't compete, but it really is a farm weapon, actually. Like, yeah, it's it's kind of a fun. I wouldn't like use it to try hard, but like it's a fun weapon. Like I would use it from time to time to play with it. I like all this ammo count. It's not that bad. It's not that bad, guys. So let me let me sh let me see the kill counts. I'm gonna give the conclusion, guys, for you. Okay, so let's see how much kills we got. So we got ten kills and sixteen deaths. <laughs> which is pretty and we were placed fourth which is pretty like, ridiculous but it's a try hard lobby so yeah so basically we just got destroyed this game so overall <laughs> what we got from this we got destroyed from this game it's good in missions in multiplayer it's average it's, it's be average to below average but is it a fun weapon it is a fun weapon i like the active skill it's pretty fun weapon i would never use this weapon in try hard like never use this weapon in try hard but it, it is a fun weapon so let's see. Would I recommend you guys grinding for this a hundred thousand points? Actually, I would, cause it's a fun weapon. If you really don't care about fun weapons and you just want broken OP weapons like the post heavy skull, then I wouldn't recommend you grinding for this. If you just want another weapon in your inventory, which is fun and you will play from time to time and have fun, I would recommend this weapon. So yeah, that was it for this video review. Thank you guys all for watching. I appreciate the support lately. Catch you guys on my next video. Thanks and goodbye.